engaging stu uh, student success through purpose. So a little <laughs> over 10 years ago in my first higher ed role, I took a group of bright eyed students down to New York City to see a little Broadway musical, Avenue Q, in which puppets play the role of college graduates pondering their futures. They sang the classic tunes, so what do you do with a degree in English and purpose? I won't pain you with belting out the tunes. If you haven't seen it, the best way I would describe it would probably be Sesame Street on crack. Crack puppets or not, it gave us some real things to reflect on. College is all about finding yourself, right? Getting our students to engage in a journey of self-discovery. I was once a psych major who spent lots of time mind mapping and journaling to help clarify what I wanted out of life, but unfortunately found no real academic space to help tie things up with a little bow to me. What is your purpose? Write it down on this index card. That question popped up for me at a special training at UNC Greensboro with a wonderful educator, Bill Johnson, referred to as the Dream Dean. I was looking for ways to spice up my work with students and gain some insights into my own career direction. During this training, a group of, educa a group of educators engaged in their own guided self-discovery over three days to create a personal charter, which essentially was a hard portfolio we presented based on a series of reflective activities. The light bulb went off for me as an educator. Now I see it. This is the heart of the work. This can be showcased to be a living, breathing e-portfolio for our students and although the questions can at times be abstract, the work is still very tangible. Pushing inquiry and reflection allows us to have our students unravel the questions of who am I and what am I to do with my life and talent? If we aren't helping students to search for their purpose, then what are we doing and are we ultimately helping them to be successful? In my current role as director of the Center for Student Success, I've seen, the ability, I've seen students through their college transition I've seen, like you, some students perform well while others struggle and some unfortunately leave. And so I've come to believe this purpose work plays a major part. Professor Joe Cusio cited meaning and purpose on his list of research in seven central principles of student success in college and beyond. And with the millennial generation obsessed with taking selfies and sharing their lives on social media, a lot can be tied into self-analysis. It seems everyone's favorite topic is themselves these days. BuzzFeed, who are you, quizzes, flood their news feed so that you can finally find out which Disney princess you are. <laughs> in the spring of a student's first year, we now offer at Manhattanville a passport fee course. This Atlas passport metaphor works perfectly for the idea of a student diving in to explore who they are and what role in the world will be. In the fall A course, students are learning about the college resources and information about their new environment. In B, this is where we can dig and the perfect place to embed purpose work. The beautiful thing about this portfolio form for this process is you get to witness and be a part of the reflection of a student's aha moment. The journey can be messy, but the beautiful thing to remind our students is that no two journeys or portfolios will be the same. Having students not only name values, but analyze and find patterns in their behavior in the classroom and their outside experiences can be particularly valuable for this process. Revelations begin to grow throughout the semester as they see themselves in their past e-portfolio entries. I find a strong connection here in assisting students to make the career and real world jump in which they can actually articulate in cover letters and interviews the specific skills and values they possess as opposed to blanket statements. Smart goal setting can also be quite helpful for that age old unavoidable question of, so where do you see yourself in five, 10 or 15 years? And in some cases, that question on some awkward first date. Students show how important it is, studies show how important it is for students to document goals, suggesting that they will be more likely to achieve those things once written. E-portfolios can also allow for visualization and personalization, allowing the student the ability to be creative. As stress continues to rise in this country regarding college tuition rates, and the rate of anxiety we see in our students also rises, making college matter for our students to find their purpose becomes infinitely important. We must all be in the business of assisting our students in their own self-discovery, one that can be beautifully displayed and examined in a digital portfolio. I believe giving students this tool and prompts to push them towards purpose will allow them ownership of their own education. I encourage students to take risks and stepping outside their comfort zones and documenting their results with the aim of self-discovery and I'm grateful that I took a risk on getting this on stage to share with you today. Thank you. Thank you.